Hi, this is Mr. McGovern. This is the third video in the wave series. We're just going to introduce light waves. So what is light? Well, it turns out that we now know that light is um, electromagnetism, and it's a wave of electromagnetism. Um, it's a transverse wave, as opposed to sound with a longitudinal wave. Um, light is a transverse wave. And we know that it's a wave because it behaves like a wave. So um, one of the experiments we're going to introduce in a video um, in about five or six videos from now, is about um, a double slit experiment um, and interference. And light behaves like we'd expect a wave to. And so that's how we know that light is a wave. So another video will go into that far more depth. And the medium that light travels through, um, unlike sound, which can't travel through space, sound needs atoms to travel through. Light can travel through the vacuum of space. Uh, but it can also travel through air and it can travel through um, water and um, transparent things like that. So the speed of light is uh, given by the symbol C, and the speed is, is very fast, 3 by 10 to the 8 meters per second, um, so that's 300 million meters every second. I think it takes about a second for light to get to the moon, just over a second for light to get to the moon. Um, it's obviously faster than human comprehension, but we could design pretty smart experiments to be able to measure that speed. And so the normal wave equation, which is velocity equals frequency times lambda, when we're dealing with light, we usually just write it as C equals frequency times lambda. Now, the colors of light that we're used to seeing, reds and greens and blues, they are actually just different frequencies or different wavelengths of light. So that's what makes up the colors. So a red has a longer wavelength than purple, but it turns out there's a whole bunch of other colors or other frequencies or wavelengths of light that exist, but we just can't see them as um, human beings. We can only sort of see a very small fraction of available light. So we see um, what we've now called the visible light spectrum. It's only visible because that's what human eyes can pick up. Um, but there's infrared light, which is, which is heat, uh, microwaves, radiation, which is a form of light, and it's effectively another color of light. Um, and, and radio waves have very, very long wavelengths, but they are just another color of light. And the other, other end of the spectrum, we have um, much shorter wavelengths, ultraviolet, X-rays, and gamma rays. They, again, are different colors or different wavelength of frequencies. They are much, much higher energy. So the, the smaller the wavelength, the higher energy, so that you can see um, they become more and more dangerous. Ultraviolets are bad for you because it can be, um, give you skin cancer or sunburn. X-rays are even worse for you, and gamma rays um, are absolutely the worst. So that's light. Um, hopefully it was useful for you.